Greetings, I'm Demonac, and it's arena time. In summary, the last video, everything sucks, I'm going to lose all the time. My deck's full of random things that are destined to betray me. As well as things that actually directly betray me by giving my opponent stuff, which I hate. It's just about never worth it. Things... There are, there are things that give your opponent stuff where it's not, like, giving you the same random thing, and then you're like, eh, okay, but... Like, giving me a mana crystal, but giving my opponent a mana crystal? That's crap. My opponent didn't have to pay anything to get that mana crystal. They just get it. It yeah, could be putting them ahead. It's horrible. And they'll, like, give us each a random spell. They could just randomly get a much better spell than me. Something like the Hungry Dragon, which doesn't tend to work out to be that good, but at least you can see how it's, like, how it could work out. What the hell? This is insanity. I wish I had the coin. Job's done. Oh, I can't do anything this turn. Now, if I play her, then the following turn I would be able to do double portals, but only if she didn't die, which she certainly will. So I'm just going to not do her right now. I do this now, and then if I don't have anything good next turn, I can play her and the other portal. You suck. You're so bad I should almost just save you in my hand on the off chance I draw one of my guys that cares about mechs. Because being able to play you for free would be bonus. But no. I might as well have him out there, potentially doing two damage to something. I'm dying. I mean, he can suicide and take out the zombie, I guess, if he gets to do one damage to it and then I shoot it. That's not good. If I don't shoot it, he can't actually suicide and take out the zombie. And suicide and take out the zombie isn't that great anyway, so there's just no winning here. Let's just see what my portal is. Just like you. And yes, I could have done it first and then maybe got something better. But... Okay. That also sucks. Take you down with me. Get two cheap bad things. That is exactly what I needed. That is some incredibly bad, unstable portaling. Like, seriously bad luck. Severely bad. Well, I guess we're going to do this, and then my opponent's going to cast one thing with, uh... Overload. Couldn't, couldn't get word. Yeah, one Overload card, and then... Oh, if you do it that way... Oh, no, but yeah, you're not using him, so you're fine. Once in a while, I get confused. Yeah, I can still shoot it. It could be worse. Unless you're going to heal it somehow. X marks the spot. Yeah, okay. Your your stuff is not so super impressive, so I'm not as like terrified as I could be. Well met. And I got a free 1-1 one -one for killing him. Good deal. Alright. Well, I got completely screwed on the random, but I'm still a little ahead in health. And honestly, it's worked out pretty evenly so far. Ah, uh, that's annoying. We worked out slightly better if she had to leave one of my guys alive, and that's unpleasant, but you know, we'll see. Is there a flame striking? Hmm. It's not gonna work out right. Now he might randomly hit me, which would be awesome. If I just play her and shoot the wolf and then see what happens. I would like to have him out for the flame strike. What He'll probably just get killed. Then again, if he gets killed, it's not the end of the world. Like, what did I really lose? But if I was a flame strike survivor, that'd be cool. Her out there. My opponent's... The thing is, as long as my opponent just puts out more stuff, I'm probably okay. I don't want to waste the frost bolt on guys who are going to get flame strike. I'm getting no health from that. Why did I bother doing that, actually? Damn it. Ah. It's just my hand's all wrong. Like, the, with the flame strike is great. The rest of my hand is not great for working with the flame strike. Miss? Damn it! I really wanted that to miss. Hitting me in the face for five would have been fine. Who knows what will Do you have a one drop? No, you don't. Okay. Hello, flame strike. Feel free to rage quit. Because I definitely do not have the game in the bag right now, so your rage quit would be welcome relief. 
I don't want to lose, damn it, this run was going so well before last video when it went so horribly. So mega bad right now. What to do? <sighs> hey. Bad. Also bad. I hate you. I hate you so much. Okay, so we're gonna this, this. This it doesn't work out great. I mean, I don't really need the two health from him healing me. That's not actually important. I want him out before I do this, because why not? What to do? What to do? So let's just uh, do it. Let's see what I can do. This so much though, I don't want to give my opponent that card. I got the best deal anywhere. I wonder how big this guy would actually have to be for me to like him. Um, that's horrible. there's a lot of cards. You know my opponent has some overload. They have enough mana right now, it's not a big issue. Hey, this the spare part would be good. Something needs tinkering? Time rewinder. Time rewinding this would be kind of nice, actually. I've got too many problems. I could trade this for that, and I've still got lose everything. What to do? Fine, to I'll do. Won. I'm just gonna do things. I should have played this too. But I hate him so much that I didn't want to. But I should have played him. That was a mistake. Wow. He's no, that's not gonna blow that up because he didn't because he didn't have any spell power, so it couldn't actually do the six damage. Or could it? It's, it's four to five, right? Yeah. Alright, at least I can shoot it now, but like this is sucks. Oh, the healing! Oh, that sucks so much! Okay, what? damn it. I can't kill them both now unless I get something from him. Sacred Drile. That's not really what I want. Oh, this sucks because the, the shooting them doesn't help much anymore. They blow him up because he fights better against other minions. Even though he's going to do more actual damage and has the potential to be buffed into crazy damage, he can't get healed anymore, which means I should be able to take him out much more easily with Firebolt plus Wand. Get in there and fight, man. That is, of course, one of the negative consequences. Okay, that's a lot of damage, but the guy's dead, so could have been worse. Sacred Trial will probably kill someone next turn. Animated armor? I don't think this is the situation for you, but I'm gonna have to do what I can. Fine, I'll want. Accomplishes nothing. It's not the time for him, but I can't do anything else. I've got nothing. I wonder how much better off I would have been if I'd put out the. 3-4 guy when I was supposed to. Or did everything get elemental destruction so it wouldn't have mattered? Yeah, it would have actually been worse off. By some strange coincidence. Is there something good? Please kill something good. No, it's just killing that. Oh, that sucks. That sucks so much ass. I hate you, Spell Slinger! I almost certainly gave my opponent something better than that, and the healing ward is completely screwing me. It's one of those games where it's totally hosing my one damage stuff. My very important one damage that I can do. And the beetle ate the sacred trial, and my opponent still has a spell from that thing. My opponent still has a random spell that could be off class. I am doing so, so bad. Even though I'm at full health and can only take one damage at a time. Doing so bad. Did 
There's a lot of toads. Oh, I need a flame strike. Oh, god damn it. This is one of those things where I'll get a flame strike and it'll be awesome, but I'll still be just sort of treading water because I got nothing out to do. Okay, well, at least I can kill him. Might as well shoot him because the wards will just heal themselves. I have no cards. My opponent has cards, though. Now, I've. Of my remaining cards, there are what? Two flame strikes? Maybe three flame strikes? Is this the game where I had the horrible, unstable portals? I don't even remember what's in my deck anymore, but there's like a good roaring torch. Wow, I've never seen that card come up, and it's completely useless right now. Incredibly useless right now. There are so many places I'm sure that card would have been fantastic, but right now I'm going to get the friggin' crap beaten out of me. I really need the flame strike now. He's got totem lock. Just spend two mana, make a totem, and then every turn if I kill this taunt totem, he'll make a new taunt totem. So I need the flame strike to clear that. Still, with the flame strike, I'll have nothing on the board. I won't be getting ahead. If he plays anything that has more than four hit points, I'm going to be in bad shape, too. Ow. Ow. Looks like his hand is all defensive stuff, which is not great for me. You're going to draw me a flame strike, and it's not going to help. Recombobulate you, and that's also not going to help. Could recombobulate you, and then Echo of Medivh, because I'm in really bad shape right now. Okay, I don't know what I'm going to be copying, though. The, I, I, this could turn into something garbagey. You might feel a little tinky. I don't know. This is so messed up. <laughs> this is so messed up. I could kill one of those if I shot, but then I wouldn't be able to echo. Damn it. I, I, I feel like I'm in bad shit situation. I needed to play that echo so I would have stuff to do, but this is still not good. At all. You guys are going to get healed. That's really bad, and that survives the flame strike. Although, if you... No, it might not. If you're not killing this guy, Flame Strike right now might do it. Flame Strike right now would be. That's not a Flame Strike. That is so un. like, insufficiently Flame Strike. A Flame Strike would have knocked him down to three, where I could have hit, killed him with this, had a clear board, and gone ahead and won the game. Now it's going to be too late. I'm going to be boned, I can tell. Hmm. Well, we're going to do what we can, which is expensively kill him. Remove the damage from my opponent's side. I still need a flame strike just to clear the totem lock. It's true my opponent cannot make a totem right now unless they like suicide their one one, but totem lock, like I I can kill the taunt totem every turn, he can make a new taunt totem every turn. And the healing totem has been really bad against me this game. Like really effective at hosing me. Engaging TC-130. Need the flame strike. Twelve cards. Two or three of these cards are flame strikes. God damn it. God damn flame strike. You might feel a little tingle. For the king! Random, but F you healing totem. You're in trouble now. You may be in trouble now. So I got a deck full of flame strikes. The hell with my flame strikes. Lightning storm. That sucks ass. And of course, it goes with the one totem I didn't blow up. I guess I should have known he was holding a bunch of things for killing my minions. So I could have guessed and taken that out. But the healing totem has been screwing me so for so long because it meant that I couldn't shoot down the other totems even when I had time. I shot him for two damage pointlessly. Still need a flame strike, and now I'm not going to get anywhere with my flame strike. Oh my God! Go to hell! Dead or alive. You piece of crap. Um. Ah, uh, it's not guaranteed enough. I'm gonna save that. Bye. 
If I could have shot that, and then this, this would have killed any two things, but I couldn't control which ones, wouldn't have been great. That's potentially bad. That's still not a flame strike. I recognize it's a large ass minion, but it's not a flame strike. All right, well let's just do this first and see where it goes. Because if it kills this, it would be handy. It would save damage to my guy. Oh, this is slam. I was thinking it was cleave. Hold on. That's different. This will give me a card. I should have done it earlier. Sorry, I thought that was a cleave. The two mana warrior card that does two damage. They'll they'll look the same to me. Okay, that's not as bad. I am so pissed off. My entire deck is flame strikes now. Like flame strike, flame strike, roaring torch. They are bad. You better not have a way to deal with. Oh my god, he's going to attack someone or something. Cross shot. That's pretty effective. That'll like slow him down a lot because I don't have anything else to deal with your stuff right now. Flame strike. Frickin' finally strike. You piece of crap. It's still not going to kill things enough. It is seriously not killing enough right now. I think I'm going to do it anyway. Get rid of those. I'll be able to kill someone. I'd rather get him, but I can kill him and not lose my guy. And I can shoot him down to half. Now, if he puts out the uh, Doom Hammer, he could do a horrendous amount of damage, but... Okay, he's going to like Crackle, okay, so my guy's dead. That sucks. Suck for a thousand. My opponent's lower on cards than I am, so I might win by deck death. I've still got decent stuff left. Uh, Blast Mage. I have not been counting cards enough to know if I have any max left. I have no idea. I'm gonna play you. Kill that. And we're just gonna play you. I'm. I honestly should know how many mechs are in my deck at all times because I have several things that care about it. I pr I'm pretty sure I have one more like Goblin Shredder in here. I can't I can't keep track to that degree. I'm trying to talk <laughs> in addition to trying to play a game and getting hugely pissed off at the amount of time it took to get get that very necessary flame strike. Another flame strike will be fine. Another flame strike could seal this. Another flame strike right now would be perfect, actually, out of these six cards. No. Um, I have lethal damage, so I'm not going to complain as much, but still screw you anyway. Screw you, deck. Screw you! You tried so hard to make me lose. I'm full of good stuff. Seriously. Okay. So we come out positive. We've got four wins now. Let's get another one, even though it's sudden death, and that sucked really hard. Like, oh my god. I'm sure you guys have counted. Did I use two flame strikes that game, or all, th or just one? Probably two, but I don't remember the first one. If I only use, if I used two flame strikes that game, I had at least one flame strike left in that last five cards. I still was not getting it. That's what I really needed. But the actual killing the opponent was fine. Jaina versus Jaina. <sighs> you asked for it. Golden Mage, of course. On. I do have the coin and an unstable portal. I don't need all of these things. Uh, I'm probably going to be unstable portaling second turn, so I'm not only going to pitch him. I'm going to pitch this too. I think, because the man is going to go like 2 3, and. I might as well have this for that turn. I know it's nowhere near as good, but also casting it earlier means they'll maybe get the Roaring Torch earlier. Now I have another three mana play to choose. Excuse me. I don't know. I've got nothing to do if this doesn't work out well, but Unstable Portal for a random win. More utter garbage. I'm going to play you anyway. You can't really screw me that hard. The worst you can do is 3 damage to me. So I coined out a 3-2. That was my turn. Whoop-de-doo. 
that's not going to work out well. The second one, they're really clogged together, aren't they? Okay, let's see what I'm getting before I do anything. Screw you! I am just not getting anything I want from my goddamn portals. Now, I am ahead on damage. I have a little bit of momentum here, but it would not take much to kill that momentum, especially since she's not so good against, say, mages. Yeah. Join or die. I can play the idiot boy. Dead or alive. I can play that makes sense, but I hate him. Raven Idol. Okay, I'm gonna get something of a choice, but I have no idea what he gave my opponent, and it's probably gonna screw me horribly. Okay, that works out perfectly. You didn't shoot her, and I can buff her to get a really excellent trade, and now I have I have actual strong board control now, whereas before I had very flimsy board control. So that worked out miraculously well, and my opponent should be pissed off that she didn't shoot my 3-1. She's going to be frustrated. Mind Vision. Okay, you got a Mind Vision, I got a Raven Idol. That is crazy randomness. At least they're, like, of similar scale. You are fireballing that guy, because I have got you that hard-pressed. Oh, I like that I have you that hard-pressed. Um, oh, that's a tough choice. Because I could Raven Idol, maybe do something great, and still do him, which is pretty great. But I think I am going to play the Pit Fighter and continue beating my opponent's face in. You're she just used a Fireball. Now. Does that mean she had two Fireballs and she could afford to spend one? Or does that mean she's going to be sad she doesn't still have a Fireball? Could have been a fireball and a polymorph. Either way, I have done a lot of damage and I've still got a lot of good stuff in my hand. Like, we're pretty even for cards, so my situation is fine. What and it looks like we both got one cost to get a good spell sort of random thing, so we'd still... The spell slinger didn't screw you me directly. Want it? I got it. Wow, that needs to die. These guys are weird, man. Like, he's fragile, but man, does he have a lot of attack threat. Like, you have to kill him. And whatever you kill him with, if it's a minion, you're going to lose it. Get in there, like, pound for pound. Oh, that sucks. Oh, that could be worse. I mean, you didn't have enough mana left to shoot her, but this, this works out okay. Because I can go... Do I want to raven first? Because I can go that, and... Yeah, I'm going to be doing this, and I'm going to be shooting the 2 1, so I might as well Raven now and see what I get. Do I want a spell or a minion? I think I'm going to choose minion. Minions can do a lot of things. Wow, is that interesting. Now, Ice Hell can't be used to finish my opponent, but I have lots of minions in my hand. If we get to this point, I think Ice Hell might help me continue winning. Otherwise, my hand's got it covered for now. Argent Commander might let me kill the opponent slightly faster, but I think I'm going to take Ice Howl, just for the crazy factor. To do. So yes, I might have been able to kill my opponent really soon with the Commander, but I think this is covering me better in case what I already have somehow doesn't work out. Because what I have is pretty good. If she's got a flame strike in her hand, she is pissed off right now because this is a shitty situation for a flame strike. It won't kill this, but you're sitting there like, what else am I gonna do? I need that to die. When you have a flame strike, but you wish it was a fireball that you already spent killing the other guy. That's demoralizing. Come on. Boring morph. Okay, this is an expensive way to kill that. Oh, I forgot the torch from the mind vision. Just giving you another fireball in your deck. Annoying in several ways, but I am okay right now. Um, I would like to use her thing right away when I play her, but I think I'm going to play the most robust bunch of stuff. Or am I? No, whatever I play can both. Anything I play can just get flame strike. So I'll just play those two. This will give me something left after the flame strike. I would have just played both these guys if I had one more mana. So now she can flame strike, but I would still be left with stuff. Aw, oh, you killed the one that doesn't give me another guy to kill you with. Okay. 
I'm pretty sure I should just be hitting my opponent in the face. I've got more direct damage coming. I've got Flame Strikes to clear the board if it comes to that. I've also got Ice Howl to clear the board if it comes to that. But yeah. So I really, I wouldn't have enough mana to use Bless's face, so I wouldn't actually have the game quite locked down yet, even then. But we're going to go like this. And like this. And... I... It's a tough choice. He can freeze a guy, which is actually maybe worse than killing him. So yeah, maybe I'll leave the 3-3. Three, three. On the other hand, this would soften up my opponent to be very close to death. Ah, oh, that is so tough. What do I do? Okay, like leaving all those guys alive is pretty bad, but even if she flame strikes, I've still got two things coming out that she has to spend all her guys getting rid of. This is only three damage, it's not the super version. But I'm gonna shoot her. It's one of those situations where I'm in such a good place that I don't think like I think either decision is fine. There should now be two Roaring Torches out of these 20 cards. So that's two cards I can pick up that would just kill her immediately. Uh, Gorilla Sizing is not good. Get a lot of card efficiency. He's not super special. As I would expect from a two-mana minion, he can be killed by one of those other guys. Freezing that is obnoxious why maybe killing him would have been better. Flame Strike would still be fine though. Flame Strike will still basically win me the game. Actually, I've already won the game if he's still alive, but yeah. Flame Strike will still basically win me the game. I don't want to give I don't want to risk giving my opponent more stuff, honestly. Uh Ice Hell can't kill her though, so should I be putting out more of these guys? It's just I might as well get him out there and doing stuff. This is intimidating and stuff. Hi. I'm big, but can't actually kill you. It's a very odd thing. Fortunately, you can kill whatever pops out of there. But... You, Ice Howl is going to do wreck so many of your minions while I put out more minions. The card advantage on that should be big. Or not! Maybe not kill so many of your minions. Just one or two. Okay. I can kill that and then turn Ice Howl into something else that costs nine. That is fantastic, Howl. Eh, still full heal, and now she can attack. Uh, I can cast this and see if I win, but I still think I'm in such a good situation that that may be more advantageous for my opponent. I am not desperate enough to do that. Giving her a random, like, nether void or something could cost me the game, whereas if I don't do that right now, I'm looking pretty safe. Yeah. If I had played that and she got a nether void, she wouldn't have surrendered! Alright, we got up to five wins. It's still sudden death, and will continue to be sudden death next time. If you enjoyed this, please click the like button. Or, on your touchscreen, please lick the like button. Warning, licking the touchscreen is not recommended. And check out our dorky, argumentative anime reviews on Anime Indecision.